In this video, you'll learn three ways to adjust the print quality of a Simplex timestamp. The first and easiest is the impact adjustment. Try this if the overall print is too dark or too light. The imprint shown here is too light, so we'll increase the impact to make it darker. Lift the stamp so you can see the adjustment pot located on the bottom. We need to turn the pot clockwise to make it darker. For imprints that are too dark, we would turn it counterclockwise. A quarter turn goes a long way. Now, let's test the adjustment. The second adjustment we'll cover is the coil frame adjustment. This is performed when one side of the imprint is lighter than the other. First we'll need to unplug the power cord to the stamp. Then remove the cover. Remove the locking pin and raise the top. Now using needle nose pliers, grab the front ribbon spool while your left hand pulls out on the ribbon spindle. Then lift the front spool and rotate the back spindle clockwise to roll up the excess ribbon. Now with the pliers, grab both ribbon spools and pull out on the back spindle with your left hand. Now you can remove the ribbon. Next, using a small straight screwdriver, we need to remove the hammerhead. Before moving on, determine which side of the coil frame needs to be adjusted. If the print is darker on the left side, it is too high, so we'll make the adjustment on the left side. Position the coil adjustment tool on the left side and strike it with a hammer. Now replace the ribbon. Ensure that the spindles seat correctly into the ribbon spools. Adjust the spindles to remove slack in the ribbon. Lower the top and reinstall the locking pin. Plug in the power cord and test your adjustment. This is a big improvement, but we can make it even better with the third adjustment. Making detailed adjustments to the rubber platen can darken a particular set of characters that may still be too light. With the power cord unplugged, remove the locking pin and open the top. Then, with a small screwdriver, remove the hammerhead. Peel off the rubber platen and place it out of the way, sticky side up. Look at the imprint to see where you need to increase the height. Place a small piece of half inch masking tape in the area that is light on the imprint. Replace the rubber platen and press firmly. Then reinstall the hammerhead. Reinstall the ribbon. Lower the top and reinstall the locking pin. Plug in the power cord and test your adjustment. Much better.